Reflecting on the past, hoping for the future. Today, people across Omaha and the country are celebrating Juneteenth. Thanks for joining us. I'm Rob McCartney. I'm Quinesia Fraser. Juneteenth recognizes the day in American history when every person who was enslaved was finally freed. We have team coverage tonight with Washington correspondent Kaylin Norwood and the effort to honor black veterans. First, KTV News Watch Evan Sean McKinnon joins us live in North Omaha. Sean. Hey Rob, hey Quinisa, here at Big Mama's, they've been cooking this morning since before the sun ro rose up. They have a Juneteenth meal special today that you can come and get, but cooking with pride is something they do here every day of the year. At Big Mama's Kitchen and Catering, Soul Food is a family affair. This is how my great-grandmother made fried green tomatoes. Each tomato is picked specifically, sliced with precision, and coated with care. Big Mama's is a staple in North Omaha. It represents entrepreneurship and history. She loved North Omaha so much. She wanted her business to remain here. Tamika Meese with the North Omaha Community Partnership is also embracing those ideals this Juneteenth. She recognizes the pain of the past, brings fire to the soul of her community to excel today. It's like what we're doing today is our ancestors' wildest dreams. And so we take that information and apply it to what we're doing today. Meese part Partners with Sherman Wells organization. They're hands on teaching kids the skills how to be a business owner or land a job. They say it's about making money legally. Free from violence, free from poverty, free from not knowing that you can create um, your own path or source of income. At UNMC, the next generation of black doctors and nurses will soon enter the healthcare workforce. Millicent Crawford takes pride in her ancestors who persevered before her. The major events, the major things that we've had to walk through uh, is so pivotal and it's been so life changing. And yet, even in all those processes, all the things that we've walked through, we still prevail. We're strong people and everyone has something positive to give, something great. And so we want to walk in our greatness and who we've been called to be. Big Mama's is, is open tonight until 9 p.m. If you still want some soul food, reporting live, Sean McKinnon, KTV News Watch 7.